Welcome Libras. I'm back y'all with another video. Let's see what, what you need to know. What does Libras need to know going into November? Okay, so you guys can check out the monthly November reads. I've done those already for your sign, so you can go back and check those out. Um, if you're cross-watching, go make sure you check your sign as well. <laughs> go ahead and hit the like button and the subscribe button. If you're a new, comment below if this message resonates with you, okay? So this is going to be for the sign of Libra. What message is there for Libra? What does Libra need to know going into November? If you would like to book... Uh, personal reading guys that information is in the drop box below as well guys i want to let you guys know as well really quick about the sale that i'm having on my website tomorrow guys i'm having a blowout sale on my website tomorrow check the description box below for the website okay but i sell oils um ritual oils all types of different oils and waste beads and sage bundles and pela santo um, just a, a mixture of things. Um, oh, yeah, intention candles that are already, you know, pre-made for you guys. All you got to do is set your intentions and light it, okay? All of that stuff is on my website, guys. And the information is in the drop box below. All right, so Libras, let's talk. Libras, let's talk. Let's talk Libras. What does Libras need to know? What does Libras need to know? going into November. What does Libras need to know? Ooh, okay. Okay. What? I'm feeling like y'all kind of frustrated. Y'all kind of frustrated. Um... Y'all look frustrated here. It looks like it has something to do with the home life. Oh. Okay. I got the King of Cups here at the bottom of the deck here. So ooh, a water sign could be involved. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Or you could just really be like in your feelings. Like, I'm getting like you got a strong feeling that there's going to be some type of confusion. Like, you could just feel it. It's a strong feeling, too. Like, you, you feel you feel like it's some confusion is headed your way. You're possibly kind of like trying to keep your distance. I got a hermit here. You could be dealing with the Virgo. Um, or you're just kind of trying to, like, distance yourself. Avoid... Uh, any type of drama here. What's the Four of Wands here? Four of Wands. Four of Wands. The Ace of Swords. You made something clear. You've made something clear already. And it's like you're not trying to be rude. But it's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. It's a lot. Um Ooh. Okay. Do you want somebody to leave? Uh, why is the seven of wands here? Yeah, I'm getting like, you're not trying to start nothing. I'm not trying, I hear it like, um, I don't want to start nothing, but you know, you, you really want to make something clear. Or you're not trying to get caught in the middle of something. I clearly see that. This is your chance now. You feel like now is your chance to uh, speak on this. 
Oh, I'm even getting a pregnancy here. Is somebody here pregnant? Or is someone's dealing with someone's mother? But this is your energy as well, too. We got the Empress and the Justice card here. That's you guys' energy as well. But I'm getting like... Are you trying to keep somebody happy? I'm getting like you're trying to keep someone happy by not getting involved, staying to yourself. You made that very clear that you're not going to get involved. Why is the nine of wands here? Yeah, but it's like your guard was up in the past. Because somebody walked away. But when they left, they left abruptly with the Knight of Swords. Somebody walked out. You walked away from somebody else. Yeah, see, something ended in the past. Because Ten of Swords and the Eight of Pentacles, like, uh, you stopped putting effort into this situation. And you just left it behind. But I do see like there's getting ready to be like some some type of heart to heart conversation. Okay, you may ask somebody, you may ask this person to assist you financially and someone gets mad. And I'm getting like they may feel like you talking down on them. I'm seeing that as well too. But I feel like you you're tired of something. You're tired of being nice. You're tired of saying you're tired of you're tired of of what you're seeing. Okay? There's something that you're seeing or you it's something that you don't really approve of, but you you don't want to really get too involved in it. Somebody here takes their slow time to to you know like they kind of drag their feet and you ask them to help you out or do something. You're getting tired of waiting for them to help you. King of Pentacles. They help you financially. You're getting tired of waiting. Now, how they're viewing the situation. that you regret something here so I, why is the tower here oh yeah there's going to be some things that are going to be said somebody keeps going back and forth or somebody doesn't have anywhere to go that's why they keep coming back um i'm getting that there's going to be like a, a conversation that's going to be had now on the other side, you you are you're good. Like this you are financially good. You're straight. You're the nine of pentacles. You're doing you know you're doing what you need to do to make sure that you're good. But you may feel like this person could be, you know, not doing their part or jealous, envious with that five of swords there. I'm even hearing like uh Cause I got the five of swords and the six of cups. That makes me feel like someone feels that if someone's children may be a little spoiled or you know spoiled rotten. I'm I'm hearing that as well. Somebody here could be a single mother or a single father. Why is the three of pentacles here? You may have told this person, look, you need to get a job or you need to leave. You need to get a job or leave. Yeah, because you feel like you are in control, okay? Because we got you as the emperor here. You could be dealing with the Aries, 
But I feel like you feel like you have control over the situation. They need to open up their options because if they aren't, yeah, see, Ten of Pentacles. If they aren't beneficial, you know, or if they aren't helping you in any way, shape, or form, they're hindering you, right? We got the devil here and the three of cups. The number three came out. The number three and the number five came out a lot here. That's five of wands, five of swords. Like, it's a lot of fives and threes here. So, I feel like you're trying not to, like, get involved in the situation or you, you're biting your tongue. Trying not to let things get out of proportion or out of hand. But, you know... You not saying nothing may not be beneficial to you, okay? You may have to take some type of action. But it looks like you either already took action or you're getting ready to because I see a tower moment and, like, things being said, okay? doesn't The tower moment doesn't necessarily mean that, oh, the world is going to crumble down and this, this, that. It's just uh, out of the blue. Like, something is said out of the blue. Like, you didn't see it coming, like someone, you know, makes a comment. You really didn't see that comment coming, you know, that type of energy. So y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Don't forget to click the bell to subscribe, guys. All right. Until next time, I'll chat with y'all later.